After more than half a century spent as the athletic director at Colleen High School, Al Doc Wilson is set to retire at the end of the school year. Channel 6 News reporter Amani Payne shows us how KISD staff, students, and the community are honoring Wilson and other district retirees one last time. Take care of them when my job is take care of them when they're hurt. For Doc Wilson, it's always been more than just a job. He's woken up eager to go to work every day for the last 57 years. I took care of other people as well as our own people. And I've always loved, tried to do the best I could. As Colleen High's athletic director and the only person to ever hold that position, Doc's a familiar face to most. And everybody in town, hey Doc, hey Doc. It's, it's, it's great seeing all these edge, edge students and people that I've known for all these 57 years coming up and patting me on the shoulders. He first took the position in the 60s as the first athletic trainer in the Central Texas area. He says he helped write the first licensing laws for athletic trainers here in Texas. And while his time on the field may be coming to a close, tonight's event proves his legacy and lessons will live on. So after hundreds of football games and a few state championships too, this trainer is hanging it up. I'll miss the friendship and I'll miss the, uh, the kids. Uh, but it's when we have to get up at 5 o'clock in the morning to go tape ankles, uh, I, don't, I don't think I'm going to miss getting up at 5 o'clock. So what's next for Doc? I don't know. <laughs> But he says it's been a journey he'd do all over again if he could. Reporting in Colleen, Imani Payne, Channel 6 News. Now, so far, Colleen High School has not announced who will be replacing Wilson when he retires. They'll have some big shoes to fill, that's for sure.